Hey there. <laughs> What's going down, my ninjas? Today's video is actually not going to be fishing. I'm going to vlog a little bit of the day today to give you guys an inside of what I do when I am not fishing, which is more than I am fishing, to be honest with you. Uh, I need to practice vlogging. I need to practice my B-roll. I need to practice a lot of stuff. So I'm going to be working on that today and make a video out of it. And uh, this trip that we're going, it's not really a big trip. We're just going to go to the grocery store and we're going to buy some stuff to eat for today. We are making nabe, which is a Japanese hot pot. It's getting cold outside. Hot pot is perfect for that. So we're going to go to the store, buy some ingredients, buy the nabe pot, and buy other stuff. So we're going to take a little family trip to the grocery store to buy the essentials to make nabe. And I guess we'll, I'll, I'll be cooking as well too. It's Sunday, so Seahawks are playing today. Cowboys, let's go. Peace. How do you like that one? So right now, uh, while my wife is getting ready, just looking for some beets, and the wife is ready now. <laughs> she needs to see us. Yeah. Go hi.
Okay, we're we're at Fred Meyer's now. When we're at the Asian store, they didn't have any. I uh, didn't have any hot plates, which is crazy. I would assume they would be there, but had to drop off the baby and the wife. They're gonna feed. Well, she's gonna feed the baby, and then I gotta stop by Fred Meyer's to grab the hot pot. So let's go. Customer, scan items one at a time, placing them in the bagging area after each scan. Fourteen ninety-nine. If you have your shopper's card, scan it now for bills. System processing. Remember to take your receipt and your change. Thank you. from the grocery store, about to prep those vegetables, cut the meat, get this nabe on the way. Okay, so if you guys are not familiar with what are familiar with nabe, it's a Japanese hot pot dish, and the broth that we use is this right here. It's it's dashi powder, and that's essentially it's bonito soup stock. So the traditional way is to get um, a bunch of bonito flakes, so it's dried up bonito, uh, and then you boil that with some kombu kelp. 
and then you remove all that and that becomes the broth. But uh, when we're at the Asian store, couldn't find any Bonito flakes, couldn't find any kombu kelp. So had to resort to just the dashi powder. 